Now, live, NBC 10 News at 11. On the Health Watch now, an exciting update to a story we first told you about several years ago. Local doctors are the only ones now in the country doing human trials on a novel way to treat cancer, one that seems to be stopping the disease without the difficult side effects of chemotherapy. NBC 10's Lori Wilson is here now with the exclusive details. Yeah, Lori? Tim, this is an incredible breakthrough, and NBC 10 is the only station to get a sneak peek at early results of the study. Researchers at Jefferson's Myrna Brind Center of Integrative Medicine are looking into whether high doses of vitamin C given with an IV can actually stop cancer. Now, this is the very first scientific study on humans, and doctors say so far the results are extremely promising. Some people are doing exceedingly well, they're feeling better, they're feeling more energized, and their disease is doing better. In an ongoing trial, people with advanced pancreatic cancer and non-Hodgkin's lymphoma are given high doses of vitamin C directly into their veins. Dr. Daniel Monti says the vitamin turns into a form of hydrogen peroxide, killing cancer cells. And unlike traditional chemotherapy that kills cancer cells and healthy cells too, vitamin C leaves healthy cells alone. That means there are no serious side effects like hair loss, pain, or nausea. What's particularly exciting is that most patients report that they feel better. They like the feeling of the vitamin C, unlike chemotherapy, which which often has a very different effect. How's your activity level been? Stacy Leonardo's decided to participate in the trial after being told her non-Hodgkin's lymphoma was getting worse, even after surgery, chemo, radiation, and a stem cell transplant. This woman really didn't have anywhere else to go. After 10 weeks of infusions, tests showed Stacy's cancer had stopped growing. They showed a stabilization, and before that, there was like continuous growth, so I thought this was great. The cancer isn't completely gone, but it's stable. Do you think she's alive longer? <laughs> it's a tricky thing to say, but yes. Stacy is continuing with the treatment. Doctors will monitor the cancer to see if it retreats. But Stacy says she's content just to stay ahead of the disease. I would be very happy with a stabilization because, frankly, I don't feel sick. Those in the trial who have pancreatic cancer get the vitamin C along with traditional chemotherapy. We're not saying that, you know, vitamin C is going to be the miracle drug that cures everything. Vitamin C will probably be an adjunctive treatment along with regular primary oncological care that is low risk, low toxicity, and adds to the quality of life of the patient. Yeah, very promising. The trial is ongoing. Now, if you or someone you love has pancreatic or non-Hodgkin's lymphoma, you may even be able to participate in this study. For more information, just log on to our website, NBCPhiladelphia.com, and search vitamin C. Lori Wilson, NBC 10 News. All right, Lori, sounds promising.